something new and different for us today. It's a Wantable box. I think I haven't had one of these in at least three months because I put my subscription on hold to only be every quarter, I think. So it's been, I think it's been at least three months. I just haven't really been loving anything on their, their uh, stream and everything's just getting so pricey. Um, Stitch Fix had been working for me because I had been getting really good stylists that have been sending me uh, all natural fabrics. So I've really been just kind of sticking with that, although I haven't even really been keeping anything from them. I don't know. We'll see what's in here. They don't send sneak peeks anymore. They wait all the way until you get your box to put the little checkout on there. So I'm dying. It's a big old box and I'm really excited. I mean, obviously fall winter is coming, so I'm sure they're sending sweaters and jeans and pants and all that good stuff. Uh, I just wanted to tell you guys really quick, I was up north this past weekend in Traverse City, Michigan. If you've never been there, it's a beautiful destination, probably one of top places to go in Michigan. It's a little touristy town. They have a very cute downtown. They have this other little area called The Village uh, at Traverse City Commons, I believe, and they have shopping there, super cute little shops, farmer's market, uh, lots of really tasty little restaurants that you can't find anywhere. They're like local people owning these like cute little restaurants and shops. And um, I found the cutest little hippo. I don't usually splurge on buying things for myself um, unless I just really love it. And I had to get this little hippo, even though it's like a stuffed animal. Um, it's always nice to like have something, I guess, to kind of like hold on to and grasp when you travel, um, like, you know, in the car or when you're sleeping. So I kind of got her for that and I named her Marty because I got her on Saturday, which was November 5th, which was Back to the Future Day. I'm a huge fan of the trilogy and I we watched it that day. I did have a wedding as well. So uh, I shot a wedding in Traverse City, which is why we were up there. I brought my husband along as my assistant. He doesn't usually go with me to weddings, but it was a friend uh, and we kind of made it as like a, uh, a a weekend, a weekend getaway. So let me introduce you to Marty the Hippo. She spoke to me. She's so cute, like very like vintagey. She almost looks hand sewn, but I think she is from a company, uh, Maleg. If you've heard of that, it's like a newborn, obviously a newborn little baby toy. <laughs> I don't know. I just love her so much. Like, look at her little ears. So vintage and cute. Look at her little eyes. And the fabric I just thought was so nice. And she's got like little, you know, beans in her butt and cute little tail. And I just loved her so much. And I snuggle with her. So... Do any of you have little stuffies that you <laughs> snuggle sometimes? <laughs> um, I don't know. She was just too cute to pass up. I just couldn't do it. So, all right, let's dive into this box. It's huge. I didn't show you the bundle before I unwrapped it, but there it is. Oh my gosh. It is like fall yumminess. Loving all these colors. This is what I told her. I love, I'm loving the autumn colors. So please send all the autumn colors, the jewel tones, the rust colors, loving them. Okay, so she says, Hi Jill, stay comfy this fall with endless possibilities for this season's cooler weather options. Can't wait for you to try out these amazing styles that are surely going to amp up your wardrobe for the cooler season. Comfy textures and flattering silhouettes are what you'll find here, so have fun with it. These are such casual and comfortable pieces that go with almost everything and will effortlessly, effort, 
effortlessly, I <laughs> can't talk. Oh, we were at a bookstore in Traverse City and the kids said, words are hard today. <laughs> That's how I feel sometimes. Effortlessly, I did at that time, exude that cozy vibe look. I can't wait to hear your thoughts on these, option, on these options. Don't forget your $20 styling fee applies to anything that you keep. You also get 20% off if you keep five or more items. My stylist is Priscilla and looking at this bundle, I think she killed it. So let's get into it. And um, I will uh, put a code below that you can click on and get your first box of Wantable if you haven't had one yet, if you haven't given them a try. I'm excited. I'm kind of excited. Okay. This cute hat. This is the Buffalo Check Pattern Knit Hat in White. This is by L.I.B. New York, and it's designed in New York. It has, ooh, fuzzy, fuzzy on the inside, and it has the cute little thing here. All right, let's try her on. That is stinking adorable. And I think it would go so good with my winter coat, which is actually this rust color. Cute. I love it. Let's fluff the hair back up. All right, so that's super cute, $32. All right, next up we have this little pouch. So cute for the Christmassy months. Has this little leather tassel on the side. This is also by the LIB New York. It feels like it has a crossbody in it. It does. Oh, and a cute little change purse. Well, that's adorable. I've been loving little bags like this, not even having a wallet and just throwing everything in it. So honestly, I really like this. And it will go perfect for the holiday season. And, and actually, you know, I always say, oh, I love silver hardware, but I've kind of been wearing some gold lately because I feel like it's more of a fall tone to wear. And I'm like one of those people, I think I look good in most colors and most tones of jewelry. So yeah. All right, so this is not leather, but that's okay. It is, hmm, $36. Not a bad price. So cute, lots of room in there. All right, next, this is so cute. I love this color. This is by Blue Pepper. And I don't think she sent the right size. I'm looking at it and I'm like, oh no. Hopefully I can try it on. And if this doesn't fit, hopefully they have the next size. I will be so sad if they don't because it's so cute. I've been looking for some very nice, just cute blouses that I can wear for date nights or out to my daughter's band concerts. This is 62% rayon and 38% polyester. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. I love it. Please fit. And she did have the correct size on here but on the tag it's the size down so it's a bummer all right this is a black sweater by b young the collection this feels like acrylic which will make me very hot One hundred percent acrylic, so yeah, that's not gonna work for me, unfortunately. But here it is. It's a black sweater. 
I did say on my list, please send natural fabrics. I said I cannot wear acrylic, so I'm a little upset by that. I do like the black sweater, but I know that I'm not going to be able to wear it. Okay, this is exciting. These are cut from the cloth. High rise Anna Fab Ab Flare, but look at this color. These are corduroys. I have been wearing flare pants this season since the summer. I'm so glad they're back in because I think with my short squatty stature, my short torso, I need that little flare at the end to kind of balance my body out. I'm a little bigger chest at the top and I just think they balance me. They, they look good on me. Um, I feel more comfortable in the flares. So I'm super excited to try these on. They're really cute. I really, really like this color a lot. So hopefully those fit. Next, we have a pair of jeans. These are by the brand Hidden. I've never heard of this brand before. Happy Flare. So another pair of Flare. Loving the color of them already. High rise it looks like. Normally I like a little bit lower of a rise, like a mid rise. Ooh, love the little, uh, what do you call that? Raw head? I don't know. <laughs> Fringe at the bottom. So cute. Love that they have matching knee holes. Sorry about my light. I have like light from my blinds that's coming in and putting a weird pattern. But um, these have some stretch in them. And oh my gosh, they are so cute. I love the wash on those so much. Oh, okay. Lastly, we have, oh, it's like a, hid, a hooded cardigan. This is by design. Again, I think this is going to be acrylic. Feels really hot. It has pockets in it, though. I see that. 75% acrylic and 25% polyester, which makes me sad. I cannot wear this fabric. I can't. But look how cute it is. So vintage looking. Ah, that's really cute. All right, let's try this stuff on and see what we think. See if we can get a few pieces. I mean, I definitely like the jeans and the cords and the hat and the bag. And then if I like that blouse too, that would be great. And I can send the sweaters back. Let's do a try on. This is such a Jill outfit. I love it so much, except for that there's acrylic in the sweater. Doesn't feel super heavy or anything, which is good. You know, it could be a piece I wear just when it's super duper cold. But what do you guys think? It's really cute. I put on, I had on this just white, Kind of boho -y top that I think I got like TJ Maxx or Marshalls or something last year. It was like on clearance and I was, I scooped it up because I just thought it was really cute. And these jeans are so awesome. I love them. Even though they're high rise and I normally like a little bit lower of a rise, it's kind of nice to have a little bit of a high rise sometimes, I think in situations like this, like I think this top with these tucked in a little bit is super cute. Love the knee holes, love the fringe at the bottom. Put on some chunky heels. Yes, this has pockets and a hood. The cardigan is the Apollo printed hooded cardigan in retro floral by design, $69. The jeans are the happy distressed raw hem flare in medium wash by hidden $89. Mm, I love them. I love them so much. I'll show you those a little bit better.
cute. Here is this top. I definitely need the bigger size, although I was surprised I was able to get this one on. It is a bit see-through, so I don't know about that. You wouldn't really want to wear anything underneath it, but I like the concept of it a lot. Uh, this part is very snug and secure, and I love this part of the sleeve. It just sort of sits there, so you don't feel like your bra is ever going to show. I might choose a different bra to wear with it as well, but, and maybe the bigger size will help. Oh, it's really cute. I really like it and I love the color. The only thing that's so hard about flare jeans is figuring out what shoes to wear with them. If you wear flares, what shoes do you wear with them? I feel like I typically end up wearing tennis shoes which most of the time is fine, but if I wanna dress up a little bit, sometimes I'm like, what do I wear with them? I just put on some black boots with, the, with, the, with these, but I love them. These are the cut from the cloth. On a flare cord and cedar, and they are $79. All right, I already uh, told you about the pouch. This one is, what, $36 by Elegant essence the tartan tartan crossbody and coin purse set in beige and then the sweater is the malaya slit jumper in black by b young 79 dollars. 79 dollars for a whole acrylic sweater no way but this is really cute i would totally wear these pants with a black sweater but not this one <laughs> I'm still deciding on this, so I decided to not try the crossbody out because it, I think, is attached and felt kind of weird to try to figure it out. So here it is. It's so cute. Like you can imagine it as a crossbody. So cute in the uh, winter months for sure. Little slits on the side of the sweater. Here's what it looks like out. All right, let's do a recap. That was such a good box. I really liked it. All right. So, you know all the prices. I went over those as I was trying on. The merchandise totals $4.23 if I keep five or more. So, this discount that I'm going to tell you is off of the seven items. But if you keep five or more, you get the 20% off too. So, you don't have to keep all seven. But if you kept all seven, it would be $84.60. Total would be $338.40. Then you have a styling fee, taxes. $337.50 is your complete total. Okay, so... I looked up and that blouse, there's no exchanges, of course. I might reach out to them and just say like, hey, do you have any tucked away somewhere? Because you sent me the size smaller than that's on the sheet and I obviously need the size up. So I don't know, because um, that could be a definite, a definite keep if they have a bigger size. Um, not gonna keep the sweater, it's just so hot. The knit hat, super cute. Don't really need another hat, but if it's like a five situation, I might keep it. It's really, really, really cute. I would definitely wear it. Um, The crossbody bag, I might keep that too. Super cute. That would be great for the winter months. Very Christmassy. The hooded cardigan, I don't know. Again, acrylic and polyester in it. 
not my fabrics. Love the vintage feel to it though, for sure. The jeans, love them so much. The flare corduroys, love them so much. The pants are definitely the winners of this box, but you know, $89 and $79, you may as well buy the whole box once you buy those. So <laughs> I don't know what to do. Do I just pick one pair of pants and just send it all back? I don't know. <sighs> Tell me what you guys would do. Cause it was great. Really, really great. Thanks so much for watching. And I'm so glad I got to do another Wantable. They did great. And I hope that if you like the Wantable that you go and check them out. Again, I will put that link down below. I think you get so some sort of credit when you try it out. <laughs> you see this? I don't know what's happening. <laughs> I think it's the itchiness in the sweater that's like making it staticky. Anyways, I think you get some sort of credit if you try out, try them out. I know that I get something too. Uh, I can't remember. It's been so long since I've done it and I've gotten a referral. So I just appreciate you guys clicking on my links, trying things out, supporting my channel by watching my videos and Give them a like and a subscribe and hit the bell for notifications and all that good stuff so I can keep doing these videos because I've been doing them for years and years and I would just love to keep talking to you guys and trying this out. Tell me in the comments what you guys are doing recently coming up and I'll see you in the next video.